actually this is a, a, a regular uh, filter with a, a you know the activated carbon and sands and rocks and basically what you see in your uh, ref refrigerator like Brita's uh, uh, zero water right. and uh, this is a, a regular filter plus our uh, graphene layer one layer of graphene is uh, you know embedded into it and basically what it does is that uh, it can clean just any types of water except for uh, salt water so if you can take our graphene uh, you know uh, filter to a river and uh, pour uh, you know fresh river water and you'll be able to get uh, fresh water just as clean as a uh, 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 bottled water with no uh, bacteria no E. coli. Wow that's pretty fascinating yes. I mean I'm thinking of countries like Africa and places like that that would really benefit from a system like I know. this. Have you spoken to? Yeah we are actually uh, going down to uh, Senegal uh, UNICEF ground force to uh, meet with uh, uh, you know ground force people to uh, help provide our system, and uh, as you know, Africa is very uh, it's, it's some of the parts of Africa is very poor, right. so uh, not a lot of people can afford to uh, buy bottled water. So uh, we, our company, can be able to uh, provide water for very very cheap price, which means uh, you know dollar fifty per day, people uh, earn uh, you know dollar fifty per day, and uh, we'll be able to. Uh, offer one liter of uh, fresh water, as fresh as uh, Evia, for uh, less than 20 cents. So what we're doing is basically putting dirty water in here, and as you can see, that's the so normal filter. Yeah, normal filter will not be able to do that. And but this is your filter. Yes. Wow, look at that. So we are currently talking with the Vietnamese government and Cambodian government as well to uh, help provide you know, fresh water to uh, their people. And you mentioned UNICEF in there yeah, as well? UNICEF yeah, UNICEF as well, okay. in Wonderful. Africa. That is really, really, that's fantastic. Thank you. Hi, my name's Tom Keenan. I'm with ID Tech X, and we're here in Berlin at the ID Tech X show. Uh, I'd like to introduce you to Mr. Jean Han Lee from Standard Graphene. Uh, Mr. Lee, can you tell us a little bit about Standard Graphene and, and what you guys do in, in the marketplace? Sure. Hi, my name is Jean Han Lee. I'm the uh, CEO of Standard Graphene, and uh, we produce. Uh, a large quantity of RGO and uh, right price and right quality uh, so market can be uh, uh, friendly to uh, our products and uh, recently we have developed a water filter system and this is our uh, uh, very fine product that can uh, save millions and millions of lives uh, you know with uh, this is current uh, current water filter system has only uh, three layers of uh, activated carbon and uh, gravel and uh, sands and this is a regular uh, water filter system and we just add one single layer uh, layer of graphene into it and we'll be able to uh, filter basically everything that you can imagine except for uh, salt water right now and uh, we're going to deliver this product to uh, Africa and uh, Southeast Asia to uh, save millions and millions of lives uh, probably starting next month and also we have a very interesting item as well this is a uh, bicycle it's as light as 5.5 uh, kilogram and if you can uh, pick it up yes yeah. oh, wow oh. and that that entire bicycle is made yeah. up of graphene basically uh, well uh, infused with graphene the yep. CFRP infused the, uh, our graphene right and uh, the rims the frames and uh, you know set, uh, saddle and 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 what separates this from a, a, a normal a normal bike? Uh, basically, uh, you can increase 130 percent strength right. in uh, uh, CFRP, and also uh, lose about 15 uh, percent of weight of regular CFRP. Okay, that's right. So great. that's it's an extreme uh, you know uh, loss of weight when you talk about you know when it comes down to uh, this kind of uh, weight right, loss. Right, right. Well, that's fantastic because um, as as we often hear in the graphene industry. Uh, everybody feels that it's still in the research stage and not in commercial products, but yeah. you're saying we actually have it in commercial products. Yes. So we're starting to move from the labs to sure. commer commercialization. Yes. Yeah. So uh, from the bicycle and uh, automobile industry, and then uh, you know later on aerospace industry. Right. Uh, right. Uh, it can be applied to. And where's that st standard graphene based? Uh, we're based in uh, South Korea, Ulsan. Okay. I see you got some products over here. Can you tell us a little bit about those? Oh yes. Yeah. So this is basically uh, what we produce. This is a RGO uh, the graphene. We call uh, real graphene. 
and this is a, a few different models of geos. So our company can uh, produce not just the one type of graphene. Right. We can basically, uh, uh, you know, produce many different levels of graphene to uh, uh, meet uh, our customers' needs. Right. So that's the difference between uh, our company and other companies. Right. So. Uh, uh, you know, we can talk to uh, painting companies, we can talk to uh, uh, airplane companies, and, and they all have different, uh, re you know, uh, uh, requests for uh, the graphene uh, quality. So we can meet those qualities. Great, great. And uh, also, this is a high conductive graphene uh, filaments, and uh, as you can see, uh, one with a regular uh, TPU, and uh, the other one with uh, uh, just you know added our graph into it, and we'll be able to lessen 11 times of resistance just adding our graph into it. So which means you can have more electricity moving faster. Why? Wow. Fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah, you know, that's what the graphene does. Well, you guys go to uh, a lot of events. I know. I know you do. Uh, how are you finding the? ID Tech X show here in Berlin. Well, it's um, well, one of the most uh, you know credible uh, uh, conference in the world, and that's why we always come here and uh, introduce our product. And people who uh, come to uh, uh, ID Tech and uh, to come to our companies, and they can definitely uh, you know believe what we do. And it's it's, it's all about credibility. So, right. ID, ID Tech is about credibility. Uh, well, we like hearing that. Yeah. Now, what do we have here? Uh, this is a uh, electrode, with, and uh, you can use this for uh, you know medical use. As you can see, this is a one-time use, and uh, 3M has about seventy percent of the market share. But we are be able to add our graphene into an electrode and be able to lose about uh, eleven percent of the uh, resistance. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, so yeah. which means that doctors can uh, detect human body's, uh, uh, you know, ac activities right. way more than just regular, uh, you know, patches. Well, that's fantastic. So, so not only not only in commercial products like bikes, but mm -hmm. also in the medical, medical industry. Medical parts. And also a cooking wear. Now, this looks like just a normal it's, Teflon frying pan to me. But yeah, but uh, it's, it's graphene coated uh, frying pan. And because of graphene's uh, characteristic of thermal conductivity, uh, this frying pan has uh, higher thermal uh, you know, heat transfer. So the water boiling point is uh, faster than a regular uh, frying pan. So I think Chi for Chi Chinese food, it's all about fire. Right. Uh, we can target our uh, market to a uh, China market. Wow, that's, <laughs> that's pretty neat. Yeah. Well, fantastic. Well, Mr. Lee, we'd like to uh, thank you very much for taking the time to thank speak you. to us today. Thank you very and much. And we hope you have a great event, and uh, uh, we look forward to seeing you in the future. Appreciate that. Thank you very much.